Picture this, an ordinary day in the unassuming town of Firovo, when suddenly the ground shakes and a huffing, puffing, mysterious train barrels down the tracks. Now this isn't your average run-of-the-mill train. No, sir. This is the Cosmic Express, a steam locomotive, belching clouds of cosmic dust, pulling two wagons that could make the Orient Express green with envy. The townsfolk feel the vibrations, a rhythmic thud-thud that seems to echo the very beat of their hearts. The children pause their games, the milkman's hands tremble, spilling milk, and even the town's solitary cat arches its back in surprise. As the Cosmic Express draws closer, its silhouette against the setting sun seems to stretch into infinity, a sight that could inspire the most hardened of poets. The anticipation is palpable, a thick fog of wonder and uncertainty. Little did the townsfolk know, they were about to witness a spectacle that would put any sci-fi blockbuster to shame. As the train halts with a hiss and a puff, the doors slide open, and out steps... No, not your average commuter, but a motley crew of aliens, each stranger than the last. There's a seven-foot-tall alien with an octopus for a head, his tentacles squirming, each carrying a different briefcase. Over there, a tiny critter that looks like a cross between a penguin and a cactus, waddling along with a squeaky suitcase in tow. You can spot a duo of gelatinous blobs, communicating through color changes, causing quite a spectacle. And let's not forget the dapper alien in a Victorian suit, looking like a lizard who's just won the lottery. The Ferovo townsfolk can only gawk, their jaws dropping lower and lower at the sight of this cosmic caravan. And just when you thought it couldn't get any weirder, the aliens pull out their train tickets. Not for the 1015 to London, but for interstellar destinations. The aliens, having stretched their legs, sipped their space lattes, and scared a few townsfolk, start to board their waiting UFOs. These aren't your ordinary run-of-the-mill backyard UFOs. Oh no, these are the top-of-the-line interstellar cosmic cruisers. They're sleek, shiny, and make no noise whatsoever except a soft hum that some say sounds suspiciously like a classic alien tune. The townsfolk watch in a mix of awe and confusion as one by one, the UFOs lift off the ground, leaving behind nothing but a gentle breeze. They hover momentarily, as if bidding a silent, otherworldly farewell. Then, whoosh! Off they go, blazing a trail of stardust across the sky, leaving the townsfolk to wonder if they'd just been part of an elaborate prank show. And as the last UFO disappears into the horizon, the townsfolk are left with one question. When's the next train due, and will it have onboard snacks?